What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel Clemente Collector and today I'm doing a special episode. How many Clemente cards do you guys think have the same image on two different cards? There's a lot more than I thought. <laughs> Let's get to it next. Heading third, playing right field, number 21, Roberto Clemente. All right, so the call went out. Uh, one of the one of the greatest YouTubers out there, Iconic Al. He's an iconic friend of mine. He wanted to see how many cards we could find that were the same photograph. And I found a lot. Um, but it's kind of easy whenever you're a player collector, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys six different uh, double take cards. So two cards, same photo. And then I'm going to show you five different triple take cards. And this is really fitting because Clemente loved to hit some triples. Um, that are three cards of the same photo. Okay, so let's start with something that Al gave me. So Al was kind enough to give me this at the National. It's a it's a dollar bank uh, pocket calendar. And actually, the Pirates actually gave out this photo one year. Uh, as uh, the, They do team photos. And this was a year when you could get a, a picture pack at the ballpark. And there is a Clemente team photo that has the same exact photo. So that's number one. Uh, at number two, um, so this is um, MLB photo stamp. It is from 1969. As you can see, they weren't allowed to use any of the names on the jerseys. Well, look at this, 1968 Dexter Press. Same exact image, but obviously the Dexter Press got, were able to use the Pirates um, logos. All right, so next up, this is one of my favorite ones. We have the Topps coin. Uh, it's uh, the 1964 All-Star coin. So that would have came out in 1965, I believe. And then here's the 1964 Bazooka card with it. So look at that pair together. I love seeing that uh, Clemente throwing. There's not enough cards with that. All right. So that was number three. At number four here, we have another um, team photo um, that came in a picture pack here. Actually, this is a Jay's publishing photo um, that came in a picture pack. And then it's actually the same photo as Exhibits. But as you see, Exhibits had to take the Pirates off the uniform. Let me get that glare off of there. So there's a match right there. Next up for the double take is um, a, one of the smallest cards and one of the biggest cards. So let's start off with biggest. We got the Topps Giants. 1964 and the top stamps i believe that was in 1964 also so we have the smallest with the biggest same exact photo <laughs> so that's really cool all right and last but not least as far as the double take goes we have the one of my favorite clemente cards of all time 1963 and the card that goes with that is one of my favorite multiplayer cards the 1966 let me put that on the screen here. So those match up perfect. I bet you didn't know that one. All right, so now we have five different uh, triple takes. Uh, so let's start off with this one. The East Hills uh, Clemente card right here. It's given out at a shopping center in the Pittsburgh area. The KDKA card, which was a promotion in the area for a radio station. That's the one from the Clemente collection. And then the Pirate Team Picture Pack photo, also, all three. So there's a triple take for you, Al. Okay, next up, this is probably my favorite triple take. I actually talked about this on a recent episode, but found another one. So we got the 1968 Atlantic Oil, okay? And then we have the uh, Transagram from uh, 1969, okay? And then we have the Dexter Press is also the same exact photo. Bet you some people didn't know that one. Okay. All right. We got three more to go. Okay. We got the Daily Juice card that is from Clemente's personal collection. Love that card. Um, we have the Pittsburgh Pirates team photo right there with the facsimile signature on the bottom. And then last but not least, we have the Harmony Dairy. Um, we have the Harmony Dairy giveaway. 
and it says Harmony Dairy down here. So there's a there's a triple take for you guys. Okay, two more. All right, this one here. Let's see here. We have the 1964 Topps Clemente card, another one of my favorites, a classic card. But did you know that the 1968 Leaders card is the same exact image? Sorry for the glare, guys. And then also <laughs> the 1968 is also, I bet you didn't know the 1968 <laughs> uh, multiplayer card was also the same exact image. So there's another triple take. All right, one last. It's one of my favorite Clemente images. So here's here's the 1961 Roberto Clemente. I love this card. Um, and it goes with the um, 1962 Clemente floating heads card. So look at that. They took his head here and made it floating. So it goes with the weedy stamp from 1964. Bet you some people didn't know those three went together. Well, I actually didn't, I had a few that I didn't bring out, like the post serial cards, two years in a row are the same, and then two years in a row are the same. And there were a couple other ones I didn't bring out, but I couldn't believe with how many cards that I actually had that matched up. It was actually a lot of fun to do this exercise. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And um, if you haven't, check out uh, Al's channel. It's amazing. It's uh, far superior to, to my measly channel. So check him out. I'll have his channel link below. And I just thank you guys for hanging out with me on this episode. I'll see you guys on the next one.